there gardeners, Amy here with Garden Up. Today what I want to talk about is this little bugger right here. Uh, this is a super common weed here in our area. So nipple wart's a super easy weed to deal with. Identification, the leaves look a lot like a dandelion, okay? It's uh, very deeply lobed as you get closer to the stem and it's got this wide egg-shaped end to it. Uh, the flowers look just like most in the Asteraceae family, little yellow um, collections of ray and disc flowers. The flowers turn into these seed heads, which can produce several seeds per flower. And it can, uh, it can multiply very quickly, so you want to get ahead of this one before it seeds. Um, but if you're catching it early in the year, just shuffle hoe it up. So it has a real small fibrous root system. It's really easy to dig this. I mean, if you have any trouble at all, just use a hori hori, you know, a real thick um, infestation of it. You might need a shovel or something, but for the most part, just pull it out. It's real easy. The stems do break really easily, uh, so you'll want to grab right at the base when you pull. For instance, grab it as far down as you can get and pull slowly, and you'll get pretty much all the roots. Nipplewort is an annual herb with leafy stems. It varies in height from about a foot. It can go up to three feet, but usually it doesn't get that tall. It's usually about a foot and a half high. So this will probably be the last edition of Weed Wednesday for this year. It's getting a little cold. The season's coming to a close, but I will resume it again next spring when the weeds start growing again. And I am gonna keep playing videos all through winter on different topics. I'm thinking book reviews, I'm thinking uh, talk about plant families, all kinds of nifty gardening related topics. Um, and whenever Lily wants to learn something about the garden throughout the winter, I'll post a gardening with kids video. Uh, so those will still keep coming. So if you haven't already, please subscribe and have a great day and I will see you in the garden.